Hello, I am Mark Oakley and I feel very privileged in being asked to continue the ministry of the Dean of Southwark. I'm only too aware that I have a very hard act to follow, uh, but I know that Andrew's kindness is going to help me learn what is being entrusted to me today. Since I was a student in London and then through 30 years of ordained ministry in the Church of England, I've always been delighted that Southwark Cathedral just exists. It's been modelling for so many years a Christian faith that is poetic, sacramental, imaginative and just. Uh, courageous to stand up for people who are made to feel less than and I am very, very grateful to Southern Cathedral for what has been, and I'm very excited to be part of what yet might be. Of course, I want to hear from you your hopes for the witness and the ministry of the cathedral. But I suppose as I begin, there are just two principles that are very uh, strong in my mind. First, as Evelyn Underhill once said, the only interesting thing about religion at the end of the day is God. And Southwark Cathedral is a sacred space. And I will want it, of course, to continue as a place of prayer, a place that immerses itself in the scriptures, a place of learning and honest, fearless conversation about the church and its integrity. I'd like it to be a place of encouragement and resource for the clergy, for the ministers, for the parishes of the diocese and for the chaplaincies. I'd like this to be a place where we take God seriously and that this is a deep well from which people can draw for their spiritual lives. But also, because it is about God, it, this is also common ground. Uh, it's a place, I hope, that will continue to feel near to uh, the people of the locality, to businesses, to organisations. And I really believe that Christian faith has some urgent resources to bring to civic society and not least in the practical help it can bring and the motivation of the human will uh, for cooperation, which will counter a lot of the cruel winds that are in the air at the moment. Uh, this is a place for partnerships and for friendships. It's said that deans are rather like pigeons. They rather like to leave their mark. Well, um, if Southwark Cathedral continues to grow in its faith, to deepen its faith, to shape Christian lives here uh, in the likeness of Jesus Christ. If we continue to find ways of speaking and sharing our faith um, with words that are careful and kind, but also joyful and resonant, and if we continue to make friendships and partnerships so that justice and cooperation can be done here and be encouraged here, then it won't be my mark, it will be the Holy Spirit at work amongst us all here. So can I please ask for your prayers? Because um, I'm a bit daunted, but I'm very excited. And I'm looking forward so much to working with Bishop Christopher, with the other bishops and archdeacons, with the clergy and the people, with the chaplains of this diocese, with the people of St. Hugh's and the congregation here. Uh, there's a lot uh, to think about and pray about, but as some of you who know me uh, will know, I often quote the words of the poet Les Murray, that God is in the world as poetry is in the poem. And it's that faith that I'm holding to at the moment and that I'm longing to share in this place.